All right, I will tell the horse joke, okay? So, there's this horse, okay? And the horse is in a band, okay? The problem is the horse is not that good at playing music. So what he does is, he goes into the other room, goes up to the cabinet, and opens the cupboard. Uh, inside, he finds the phone book. So he grabs the phone book. He flips through the pages, like A, B, all the way to Straight M. Over here. He gets to M and he starts looking for music teachers. So, he looks down the phone book and tries to find lots of music teachers. There's lots of, um, like, A music, B music, like all sorts of music teachers. So, he ends up deciding, you know, I'll go for, I'll go for this music teacher. Now the horse, the horse plays guitar. The guitar, the, he plays the acoustic guitar, not the electric guitar. He thinks the acoustic has a nicer sound, so he tries to stick with the acoustic guitar. So yeah, anyway, he goes to the phone book and he looks for um, music teachers. Keeps looking, looking, looking. Uh, he finds the music teacher he wants some, um, and he, he gives him a call. And he said, hello, is this the music teacher? Uh, yes, yes, this is the music teacher. Um, I, I'd like to uh, learn music. And he goes, okay, no worries, so what do you play? Um, and he said, oh, I play the guitar. And I'm like, oh, cool, what sort of guitar? And he goes, well, I play the acoustic guitar. I think it sounds better than the uh, electric guitar. You know, it just has a nicer sound. Like, oh, yeah, fair enough. So they set up an appointment. They decide on 3 o'clock as the appointment for the uh, first lesson. He was going to do 2.30, but he was busy then. He wasn't sure if he would make it, so he decided to go for 3 o'clock. So anyway, he goes to bed that night and wakes up the next day and proceeds to run his errands that he was running until it comes to about three o'clock. He then proceeds to head off to his music uh, lesson. Wait, though, two seconds, let me just figure out where I'm going. Yeah. He then proceeds to head off to his music lesson. So he arrives at the music teacher's for his music lesson, um, having brought his acoustic guitar. Now the reason he wanted the acoustic guitar was because it sounds better than the electric guitar. Anyway, so he goes into the music teacher's like office with his, uh, into the music, into the, into the music studio with his acoustic guitar. And he finds the music teacher and says, uh, Hello, my name's Horse, I'm here for my 3 o'clock music lesson. Uh, no worries, I'll just check the system. So she checks the system. Yep, and finds the uh, horse's appointment, books him in, and then takes him in. Notes that he arrived for his lesson all that, and so the horse goes into the back and starts uh, learning music. So anyway, they start off learning a couple of chords, they learn the C chord and the G chord, stuff like that, you know, some pretty basic stuff. The horse, feeling like he got his money's worth, is quite happy with the lesson. Leaves them, leaves them a good review on Google, and uh, makes appointment for uh, some more lessons. Anyway, he continues um, to attend these music lessons, um, and he starts to get better. He learns more chords, and he learns songs, and he actually starts to get really good at playing the acoustic guitar. Now, the reason he wanted the acoustic guitar was because it sounds better than the electric guitar. Anyway, so he takes his acoustic guitar, and he meets back up with the members of his band, and they say to him, Horse, how are your music lessons going? And he said, they've been going great. I started by learning some simple chords, and then I learned some songs, and now I've gotten actually pretty good. Anyway, so they decide to start jamming, blah, blah, blah. And the horse is actually pretty good. He can play his acoustic guitar. My internet just dropped out for a second, and I'm pretty sure that was a mercy killing. <laughs> anyway, so he can't be playing his acoustic guitar. He's getting quite good at it. Anyway, he, uh, he continues on, and uh, they eventually manage to secure a gig playing some music at a bar. They're all really excited. So, the gig is on Tuesday. I thought it was mine, no. <laughs> no, my in for people's reference, my internet does cut out randomly every now and again, but it comes back on like a second because Australia, yeah. Um, so yeah. Anyway, they're playing the, the uh, they get the the gig playing at the bar. So, a couple of days roll around. Really long joke. No, it's the best joke. So yeah, the couple more days roll around. It comes the time of the gig. So they get up there and they play. And the horse putting all of his music lessons together on the acoustic guitar. Now remember, if you remember correctly from earlier, he chose the acoustic guitar because it sounds better than the electrical guitar. And so they play them. They play a song that's amazing. And it, there's great. There's a standing ovation in the bar. Oh, I loved it. And so he books them for another gig. And they're, you know, they're over the moon. 
You know, they, they were just a small band with a horse that couldn't even play the guitar before. And now they're getting, you know, getting booked for gigs. It's amazing. Anyway, it's all this. And then, so, Horse decides we're going to continue the music lessons. But this time, he actually is busy at 3 o'clock. So he decides to shift the music lessons to 4.30 in, in the afternoon instead. So, that's all fine. He rings up the music instructor and says, Hi, I'm actually busy now at 3 o'clock. Could I possibly reschedule my music lessons for 4.30? And he goes, No worries, that's no issue at all. They booked in Horse, and he was good to go. Now, he proceeds to continue attending his music lessons because, you know, you you learn the instrument, but you've got to master it, right? So anyway, he continues learning his instrument, which is actually an acoustic guitar because it sounds better than an electric guitar. Anyway, he continues doing that, and they go to the second gig, and he sounds even better at this gig. The practice is just really showing off, and he's just, you know, he... He is, uh... <laughs> And it was really showing. He's just getting better and better and better. And it's just, it's, it's amazing. You know, a horse playing the acoustic guitar, because it sounds better than the electric guitar, um, is just doing so good. And then, the strangest thing happens after, after this gig. They're approached by this strange man. This man is a talent scout for a famous recording agency. You know, and then, needless to say, the band members, including Horse, the acoustic guitar player, are just blown away. This... This record deal executive just, you know, wants to give him a record deal. It's, it's, you know, it's more than they could have ever dreamed from. So anyway, they proceed to book in a time where they can have an interview and possibly go record some tracks. Now, they go to the interview. They had to change the scheduling. It was booked in for one o'clock, but a horse was busy again, so they had to shift it up to two, but it was fine, so they shifted it up to two, and he pretended the meeting at two. Showed him off to the other record executives, and they loved him. They loved horse and the band. It just, they sounded amazing, and they signed them right there and then. All right, see you, Timber Tam. Yeah, they signed him, they signed them right there and then. So then they proceed to record some tracks. And then, after a couple of months of recording tracks and uh, getting some marketing done, they release an album. Album, Horse on the Acoustic Guitar, and the rest of the band. Bit of a weird title, but the horse actually plays an acoustic guitar, because it's better than an electric one. Which meant it actually made sense, because the lead uh, instrument on this was the horse on the acoustic guitar, because it's better than the electric guitar. Anyway, so they proceed to release the album, and the album is a huge success. It goes platinum in the first two minutes. So anyway, the album is a huge success. Horse gets a good, you know, Horse becomes a millionaire overnight, and the rest of the band members as well. It's just insane, the level of wealth that these people, these these animals acquire. I'm gonna pause yeah. during the cutscene. You sure? Yes. Guess the universe really wanted her dead, huh? There's nothing on her. What the? Why is my... My thing's glitched. Wait. Shit, my thing actually glitched. Two seconds! Two seconds! My capture card software glitched and it blanked out the screen for me, so I actually can't see the gameplay. Alright, we're good now. New Jackson. Look at their fucking smiles. That's her. That's the one who killed him. Three 
Three down, right? Three down. Six fifty-two. Do you copy? Support unit India en route to the TV station. Repeat. Support Shit. unit India en route. Yeah, we Over. should get going. Yeah. So anyway. I do think in the first week he's though, maybe. How do you feel? Piss we couldn't talk to her. Anyway, so yeah, the whole, the record goes platinum in the first two minutes, and it's just amazing. You know, they become millionaires overnight. I'm gonna keep playing because I think you'll uh, kill me if I pause the gameplay while I talk. Um, and it goes, it goes platinum. They're, just, they're millionaires overnight. It's amazing. It's unprecedented for a band of this size and, and renown just to go pl platinum and become this famous overnight. So, needless to say, they were called in to record another album. But the thing is, Horse, still not 100% sure on his uh, musical talent, decides to keep going with his music lessons. So, he calls up the music teacher and says, Listen, I may have gone platinum with this album, but I still want to hone my craft. So, could I please uh, book in some more music lessons? And they're like, no worries. Um, would 4.30 still work? And like, I'm really sorry, I'm recording now. Could we shift to a morning session? I'm like, oh, we don't really have any morning sessions. We can do noon for you if you'd like. Uh, Horst thought about it. Um, and he's like, you know, I can fit in noon. That's fine. So, they agreed to schedule the, the uh, music lessons for noon. And Horst continues to go to the music lessons. He actually steps up. He goes twice a week this time instead of just once a week. Because he really wants to step this up and make sure that he can produce the best music he can for all of his fans. So then the time rolls around, the time to record, they decide to record a second album. Now this album, which they titled Album 2, starring Horse on the acoustic guitar because it sounds better than electric guitar and the rest of the animals. It's a bit of a long title, but with the success of their first album with such a weird title, they decided to stick with it. So anyway, they proceed to get a second album out. And this one doesn't go as well as the first one. The sort of first one was sort of a bit of a fluke, but still it hits platinum in the first 20 minutes. Not the two minutes it, it uh, originally got for the first album, but for 20 minutes, but still very respectful hitting platinum in 20 minutes. Needless to say, millions more was made by Horse and the rest of the animals. And it's just, it was amazing. So what they decide to do, they decide to go on a tour. What, what better way to make to make more money and uh, spread their music than to go on tour with it, yeah? So they organize a global tour. They decide that they're going to visit the UK, France, Sweden, Spain, the Netherlands. They decided to visit Portugal after that, despite the fact they were already in Spain. They decided to go and back over, but that's no, nothing to worry about. They de decide to visit the United Arab Emirates and then head down to maybe South Africa. After that, they decide to go... Uh, up to uh, Beijing in China, um, which so may seem a bit out of the way, but it's just the way it ended up being planned out. And then after that, they were going to go do the rest of Asia and then probably come down to Oceania, maybe do New Zealand and Sydney, Australia. And it was going to be a great concert. Needless to say, tickets sold out instantly. If you, if you got a ticket, you were the luckiest person in the world because you were going to go see Horse on the Acoustic Guitar, because it's better than the electric guitar, and the rest of the animals in concert. Two people that have had two platinum albums. It's amazing. It's just, you know... It, it, it's just... it's This was more difficult than getting your hands on a PlayStation 5 during 2020. It's just absolutely insane the level of luck you had to go to to get the, your hands on these sort of tickets. So anyway, they proceed to go on tour. So they go all, all around Europe and Asia and South America and Africa and everywhere. They go everywhere. It's a world tour. They decide we're actually going on a world tour. So anyway, they proceed to go on their world, their world tour. Horse obviously had to postpone his music lessons because the music teacher wasn't actually going to um, uh, fly around the world with them to continue tutoring him in music. But that's okay. So anyway, he proceed. They proceed to go on tour. They go to all their places and the crowds are wild. A doggo eight oh three. Thank for the follow. You can have a ticket to horse on the acoustic guitar and the electric guitar. Because the, because the acoustic guitar is better than the electric guitar. <laughs> you can have a ticket to the concert. Um, yeah, it's amazing. The crowds are going wild and it's amazing. It's They made more and more millions. It is just insane. Horse is now one of the richest people. Unfortunately, horse starts to fall in with a bad crowd. 
and Hall starts to get on some drugs and stuff, and it's just, it's insane. Like, he starts to go down, like, he starts to go down the toilet with all the drugs, and he stops showing up for, uh, practice. He even, once he gets back from the world tour, doesn't keep scheduling his music lessons. He decided he was good enough, and the, the drugs were starting to rot his brain. He was actually getting worse. It's just, it's a really sad story. So anyway, after all the concern of the band, they tr they try to reach out to Horse, but he just wouldn't listen, would he? Horse just was too, just just did not want to be part of the band anymore, despite their, their incredible success, just did not want to be part of it anymore. So anyway, um, so he doesn't jump on the high horse exactly. <laughs> So anyway, he's having this big drug problem, and they tried to reach out, but he just, he didn't want anything to do anymore. And he ended up that on one occasion when they came, when the whole band came by to try and find him and support him, he actually attacked one of the other band members. It was insane. They didn't talk to Horse again after that. He attacked another band member. That's just... He's, he's clearly go too far gone. It's not worth it anymore. So anyway, um, Horse constantly is just fighting this drug addiction, and there's just nothing that they can do. Might have heard something. Just for making sure I can I'll get through here. <laughs> so anyway, they they give up on Horse. It's just not worth the effort anymore to try and help him. Ah, uh, this goes on for many years. Horse just sinks further and further and further down the spiral into drugs and alcohol and and uh, I don't know the word for female horses, but in, but for female horses, <laughs> but it's just it's a it's a come downward spiral and horse is just getting worse and worse by the day. So one day, very luckily, his music teacher manages to get through to him and just contact and says, horse. What are you doing? You're put, putting all this to waste. You put you put out two platinum albums and a sold out world tour and you're giving that all away for drugs and women. And it's just not like you. So Horse, you know, not being of sound mind, kick, kicks her out. Horse just had, seems like a, a mare. Thank you. Uh, Horse just seems like he's give, completely given up on music. It's... He even gets rid of his acoustic guitar and no longer was concerned about whether people thought the acoustic was better than the electric. He just could not care anymore. The one thing that he truly, truly believed that acoustics were better than electrics, he just did not care to defend anymore. Uh, after the music teacher left, Horse sat down with another drink and some drugs and started to quietly reflect on the whole situation. Just what had he become? What did he become? It's just all the alcohol and drugs and mares. It's, it's just insane. He needs to he needs to fix up his life. What what is he doing? He can't live like this. It's just it's it's not the way horses should live. So he decides screw if I, I I need to get out of the house. I, I need to get out. He started to fall into a deep depression. I need to get out of the house. So he decides, oh, I, I need I need more alcohol. I'm just going to go to a bar. Hopefully no one will judge me. So the horse walks into the bar and the bartender says, why the long face? This area's clear. 